What would a beautiful woman choose among five top popular niche fragrances? I am going to drive over to my friend's house now where she is going to do a blind smell test. And what she doesn't know is I'm slipping in a fragrance that I created on my own. She has no idea. I'm going to put that in among the other five and let her do a smell test and see what she picks. Stay tuned to find out. This is going to be interesting. Okay, shh, I'm here at my friend's house. Again, she has no idea that I'm going to be sneaking in my own secret homemade fragrance among the other five. So I'm going to go on in and we're going to get this started. All right, guys, welcome back. Joel the Nose. And as you can see, I made it to my friend Sherry's house. I drove over here and I'm going to do this. First time I've ever, we've ever done a video, right? I know, you've been telling, he's been telling me for quite a bit to do it, but... Um, for like over a year now, she's been promising to star in a video with me and, uh, you know, smell some of these wonderful creations and pick out her favorite, but finally. This is gonna be a challenge. Okay, no, 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 I think it's gonna Especially be fun. Especially after getting my COVID thing. Oh yeah, yeah, but has your, sense of smell come back mostly or yes i, I that, that's why I, I say it like that this is gonna be like i want to prove myself to see if the senses are actually good yes but and, i feel yes okay so also a little background sherry's mom is you know sherry has an extensive knowledge of fragrance herself she's not like just you know the average girl who's like smelling fragrances for the first time i mean right your mom worked for clive christian joe malone right right correct my mother was a clive christian representative for many many years and before that she was also representative at nordstrom uh and yeah. she was also representative of joe malone so uh not only that my husband also worked in the fragrance industry for many years and uh, yeah. so we have a little collection of very unique Little collection. Her, her collection is probably bigger than most of you guys out there, and that's saying that's saying a lot. So she's, this is, you know, a good, this is Sherry the Nose almost. All right. <laughs> Let's do this. All right. So without further ado, this is what I'm going to do, guys. I have six bottles here, and what I've done is just picked, like, you know, basically some of the biggest houses. I have Parfums de Marley. I have an Aqua de Gio. I have Montal. I have Serjoff. Okay. And what I'm gonna do is, we're just gonna kinda of do a blind test. So turn your head to the side because I don't want you to see what I'm spraying. All right, and let's get right into this. So guys, I'm gonna show you in the camera. Here. Oh, no, the, I don't want you to look, don't look. Right now I gotta switch because I don't know if you saw that. All right, keep, yeah, just keep turning to the side. So again, you let can guys know, see here, this is the first one that I will be spraying. And I'm not cheating, I promise. I know. <laughs> All right, so here you go. You can take it and smell it. And... Okay. Do I have to say now? No, no. I mean, you can. You can tell me what, what your impression is. This is very refreshing. Okay. And, um, and light. I want to say. Um, yeah, give me another one. Okay. All right. So that was the first one. Okay, don't look down because okay, I, I'm okay. going to put the things under the bottles. I have everything down here. I don't want her to see. All right. Next, we are going to go here. And guys, I'm going to show you. She's not looking. Here we go. Everyone knows that bottle, right? She doesn't. And here you go. You can... Mmm, interesting. What do you think you smell? Or what? Oh, sorry. She's on a stepladder, by the way. She's not this tall, or I'm not this short, if you guys were kind of wondering. <laughs> <laughs> She's on a stepladder like this. I mean, like without, this. without it, it'll yeah, be like yeah. this? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'd have to, like, hold it up here. No, no. Okay. Okay. So I want to say this one is more woody or like earthy a little bit more earthy than the other one okay a little bit more yeah all right so 
Go ahead and turn so you can't see. Or like spicy. Spicy. Okay. I think actually that's a good description. That's a, I would probably say that one. Okay. There you go. Oh, wait. I'm sorry. Actually, let me show. I didn't show everybody. So here we are, guys. This is bottle number three. And now you can take it. You can look. <laughs> I can look? Yep, you can look. Okay. Mmm. A lot lighter than the first one. A lot. So the first like, one you thought was lighter, the first one, and then you said this is even lighter than that. Like smoother, I want to say. Okay. Um, more like an aqua of something. Aqua, like, you mean like marine? Like No, no, like, like. Like watery. Um, like watery, okay. more like these, salt. more diluted. Okay. Like oh, lighter, oh. smoother. Okay, I understand what you're saying. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. Okay, go ahead and turn. All right. Now, oh I'm gonna come in at guys. Don't or she's not looking. This is the number four. All right. Hold on. All right, you can, you can. You sure? Yep, go ahead, I already put it away. Cinnamon, like this definitely has like, a lot spicier than the other one. Is that even a word? Yeah, spice, yeah, of Spicier, course. spicier. Spicier, yeah. Okay. She, so, explain. Yes. She's from Venezuela I'm originally. Venez I'm Venezuelan, so yes. my English is not very good looking. <laughs> <laughs> That's a Mark Anthony reference for those who don't know Mark. Ta ta tag him there. Ta tag him here so he can see the video. Yeah, yeah. Okay. okay. This one has, I feel like a cinnamon or like some type of spice like that. Okay. Go ahead and turn. Okay. Like sweet. It was sweeter. That one was sweeter. Okay. All right. We're coming in now for that was... So that was the number five. I think I counted everything wrong. So now we're coming into the last one. I'll show you guys here. All right, everyone there, I hope recognizes this bottle because it's very recognizable. All right, hold on. Let me put the thing down and there you go. Okay. Well, because, you know, hopefully my subscribers who are watching, most of them recognize a lot of these bottles. I picked again very, okay. very popular houses. Mmm. Okay. So now what do I want to most? Well, actually, you know, I, I've got one more that I want to do. Wait. Okay, this one. This one, I don't know, it confuses me. And it makes me want to sneeze, though. A little bit. Okay. Um, I don't know. It's a... Uh, I want her to have like an allergy attack here. No, but I like it. Okay. It's um, it's fresh too. Okay. Very fresh. Okay, go ahead and turn. Because I, I got one more I forgot that I brought. Hold on one second, guys. One and, more. And then what do I do? I need to name them, each one of them? Yeah, we're gonna, I'm going to have you then, I'm going to give you each of them and have you smell them again. And then I want you to tell me which ones are your, kind of rank them in order. Okay, got it. Okay, so this is the last one. Here you go. Oh, actually, no, sorry. Let me show the bottle. Let me show the bottle, guys. Everyone, of course, I know everybody recognizes that. Here you go. Okay. Love it. It's very old school, though. Old school, okay. Like, like well known. I th I want to say like I've, yeah. Okay. Light, very smooth. Okay. Very refreshing. So now what I'm gonna do? I guess. Is I'm gonna so I have all. What do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, because the I had five, so we have six here. All right. I'm gonna have you, I'm gonna give you each one again, and just so, so turn, and I'm just gonna go ahead and have you rank them. So here you go. 
How do I rank it? Like, which one do I like more? Yeah, put it down and tell me, you know. Okay. I'll hand them, I'll, what else, I'll, I'll hand them to you each one at a time here. Mm. You, okay, give me another one. Okay. Okay, so this one is sweeter. Okay. Okay. This one's sweeter. And uh Okay. Can you smell it again? Yep. Then I feel it more. Alright, so I'm gonna give you Okay, more like yeah, I definitely like the sweeter that this one, the sweeter one. It's like more interesting. The sweeter one, okay. Mm, okay. Okay. No. I don't know. This is too too fresh. Too fresh. All right. So I, right now that's going to be probably number six, but we'll see. Okay. A two. Uh oh. <laughs> I know it can be overwhelming. This one is cinnamon and clove or, or wait no butter butterscotch or like so that has caramel in it caramel okay caramel yeah so it's good yeah it's also got cardamom that's where you cardamom spicy. okay uh, okay yeah I like more of this one okay I still like more of this one. So we still got, what we're going to do is we'll just pick the, oof, the overall number oof, one. Oof, <laughs> Sexy. This one is sexy. But this one too. And They're then, actually very similar. Smell this one. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I, I think I know why. Because this one here has kind of like pineapple and... and a little bit spicy fruit at the top. And this one, by the way, has apple and cinnamon and spices at the top. And then... I feel the apple. It's, yeah, it's definitely the cinnamon, yeah. And then okay. this is the last one where we're still... You got to re-smell. <sighs> okay. <laughs> okay. This... this All right, so guys, just deep. to let you know, these, so the three finalists for the top three are... We have the original Santal from Creed. We have Parfums de Marley Habdan. And we have Udin by Serjov. So these are your three finalists. Okay. The other ones, I, I, you know, whatever. The, the bottom three were, by the way, Oud Forest by Montal. Aqua de Gio, the Eau de Toilette. I'm glad because that sucks. That's designer cheap fragrance. You know how I feel about that, guys. And this was my homemade one. This was the spicy caramel. Uh, I made this one. Interesting. So I didn't tell you. I didn't tell her, guys. You know, that was a little thing that I withheld at the beginning of my video. I said that I was going to surprise like you it. and I was going to sneak it in. That's the one that I said that was similar to the other one or no? Uh, well, you said it was spicy and it was, uh, it was the one with the cardamom and the caramel. Got it. So, anyways, that was, you know, those are the bottom three. Let's see. All right, so now let's round it out. You have the final three here. Let's see what she does. Try to rank them in order. Your three favorite. I think I have them in order. Well, I mean, oh, you do? So you think that's... This order. So... All right. So what's number three? Number three. All right. Number three is Creed. Santal, I think you kind of nailed it. You said it smells old school and fresh. I mean, this is classic Creed, you know, gentleman's old school fragrance. It's very... Classic. I guess very classic, very I guess fresh. the word was classic. Yes. Not, not old school, classic. Classic. Well, but either yeah, way. Old school, exactly. Old school to me is the same thing. But yeah, okay. So that's number three. Number two is... Number two... Ooh, I, I thought this might win it out. Number two is Habdan by Parfums de Marley. Uh, one of my favorites. This is such a beast. But yeah, this is number and two. I love the bottle. Right, feel the cap. 
Watch this. She's never felt something like this. All right, go ahead and take that cap off. Woo! It's like a weapon, huh? It I is. Mean, you could I was just going to say the same. Uh-oh. You get in a fight with your husband? Just throw that at him. Okay. <laughs> throw the bottle of perfume. The, just the, the cap. And the winner is... The winner is of the blind test taste is Udin by Serjoff, the Italian mm-hmm. niche designer. I got to say, I get more... I mean, I get so many compliments from, compliments from this one. I told this story recently. The biggest reviewer out there, everyone knows, Jeremy Fragrance, last year, about this time, was in Miami. We hung out a little bit. And we had lunch one day, and I was wearing this from across the table. He immediately was like, Joel, what are you wearing? He's like, I can smell that from over here. And he was like completely flabbergasted. He'd never smelled it. He was like in awe of this. Let's see how it smells on me. Okay. Yeah, that would be good. Let me see how that... Because it it, it, it could be totally different, right? So, yes, by the way, this is That could be part two of your video. What? Mm, to talk about the difference and how it smells. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's like different it's a big perfumes. difference. Big difference how it smells on your skin from the paper. We're just doing a paper here test to here today, guys, because I didn't want to spray six you know, fragrances on you. But let me smell. Wow. It smells great. It's got that kind of like grapefruit top. It's like grapefruit. You smell that? Like in spice and it's, you know, beautiful fragrance. It's very fruity. Yeah. Sweet. And by the way, this Udin is a fragrance that lasts all day. I mean, that will be on your skin all day, all night, and it's amazing. And it's also, these are all unisex. So, with the exception of I this. I didn't know, and I just spread it on me. Aqua de Zio like is, is, is masculine. This is also Santal's for men. But these, all these here are all unisex, so they can be worn by man or woman, depending on how, it, you know, it wears on your skin. So... There you have it, Sherry. Thank you very much. Thank you. I appreciate it. Our first fragrance video together, and I'm sure they'll be asking for more. So you know, hopefully you'll come back and do another one. We'll we'll pick out another topic. This is Joel the Nose. If you have not already subscribed, please. It helps me stay motivated to give you more content like this. And don't forget to ring the bell for notifications. That way, every time I get a new video, you get notified of it so you don't have to hunt around for my videos and you can like the video, of course, as well. Joel the Nose, I will be back soon with another video. Thank you, Sherry. Thank you. Bye, guys.